So here we are, we've just arrived. Posse number one. Yeah, we're gonna get some burly in the water, start catching some liveies, and then see what uh, see what else we can we can catch on those liveies. So yeah, can't wait. Here's Caleb using the latest from Alvi, the Orbiter OSR160. Designed in Australia, and Alvi's put their name to it so you know that these are great quality. With an aluminium body and 16 kilos of drag, Caleb thought that these would be up to the task of fighting some kingies. Let's see how he gets on. Kingy! Yeah. Got it already. Oh, there we go. On the old uh, Alvi. Yeah. Little rat. A little fella. And. One, two, three. He's gone. There you go, new LV SR200. Rig him up. Going on the LV orbiter rod. Yeah. So the combo that Caleb's got here is the LV orbiter RO100 rod. So this is a seven foot, eight to 10 kilo, Ready to cast 14 to 42 gram two piece rod, ideal for soft baiting. So these rods have got a Fuji reel seat and Fuji guides. I class them as a medium tip action. And you'll see that that rod is paired with the SR200 reel, which is the same as the new 100 plus, which is the equivalent size of a 4500 size reel. So this range comes from the SR60 right up to the SR200 or the SR100 plus which it's now called. The bigger two sizes are the 100 and the 100 plus. They both have 10 kilos of drag. The 80, SR80 has 8 kilos of drag and the SR60 has 6 kilos of drag. Ah, that's a nice little honey. Oh, it's a big one, but big little honey. <laughs>
Ah, nimm mal. Danke. Now that Caleb's caught his livey, he's going to cast out his sinker for his slide bait rig and throw that cow eye out there and hope to catch a decent sized kingy on it. such um, big liveys we may get some sharks but it's all a bit of fun and when you're in the far north big liveys can very much so get taken so hey we've got a couple in the bin now it's just about having some fun we'll get the drones up start sending them out as well with some uh there's puppies under my feet right now so, yeah. so uh I think there might be some tremors around as well, so hey, it's all about having some fun on big fish and the far north. Out of the field, bro. That's a PB, bro. Yeah, that's a PB. Well. Ah, that was a big, big cutaway. <laughs> yeah, bro, what yeah, the big one? Nah, I can't wait to clean up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, bro. Don't you come off, don't you come off. Thank you. 
not moving like a tree. That could be a catch one fish, Cohub. No, I see. We get fish around the black. No, I see. Yeah, it's the one, eh? We can come down and get a feed, Cohub. You got some other feet there if you want any. Um. Get out. A trip. No, 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 So dragging in these Trevally one after another, sometimes two or even three at a time, no problem at all for these LV Orbiter setups, great value. So now we know what the smaller LV Orbiter range can handle, let's have a look at the LV Offshore. So these little reels pack 30 kilos of drag, which is enough to stop just about anything out there. And they're a 2 speed with 6.5 to 1 and 3.8 to 1 gearing, so ideal for jigging and trolling. And we've got that set up on the LV ROS 300 bespoke offshore rod. Stay tuned to see what we catch on this.
On the LB, two of them on the LB. Two kingies at once, and still brought those in easily. Put back for another day. All caught using the new LV range. Great day out. Make sure you subscribe to our channel to see what else we get up to, and head to fishingtacklesale.co.nz for any of the reels seen in this video.